Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Cars and Cloud. So in this video, I'm going to show you a couple of best practices, how to protect your Zoom meeting from intruders. So now let's get started. Just say if I want to uh, schedule a meeting. When you create a meeting for meeting ID, you want to make sure you choose and generate automatically. Don't choose personal meeting. Personal meeting, if somebody who accessed your meeting before by accessing your personal meeting link, they will have access to your meeting. So make sure choose generate automatically meeting. And password, you want to make sure it's require meeting password. It's recommended, it's highly recommended for security risk or security reason. So these are the only two items that are required in order to protect intruders from accessing your meetings. So I'm going to cancel this. Just say if you are in a meeting, I'm going to start a meeting here. I have my cameras off, that is fine. So once I'm in this meeting, I can click on security here. You can you have to make sure you enable waiting room. That means um, you allow people access to your meeting. You want to see who is on the meeting or who is waiting for to join the meeting and then you allow. If you don't check this box, the participant will join your meeting automatically without your permissions. So this is highly recommended enable waiting room. Once you have everyone join your meeting already or everyone in the meeting, you can go ahead and lock your meeting. Lock meeting mean no one else can join your meeting after you started the, the meeting sessions. And as you can see here, once you enable lock meeting, your meeting items uh, title here, it says meeting is locked. So no one else can join your meeting. So those are the settings that are highly recommended for to prevent intruders from joining your Zoom meeting. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe and have a wonderful day.